Hello guys, welcome back to the Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. Today we are going to discuss the formula which is the d square divided by the 162.162. So what is this formula and why we use this formula? This formula is very really important in calculating the in quantity estimation. And this formula is used to find the unit weight of steel bar unit weight of different steel bar right steel bar in the unit of kilogram per meter it means this formula gives us the value of the weight of the steel unit weight of the steel bar in the unit of kilogram per meter and from this formula then we can find the total length a total weight of the steel bar i will also do one example the complete example to know about how we find the weight of the steel bar from this formula first now i'm going to show you the different steel bars diameter that how we find the different die bars meter the different unit weight of each of them so here on the left side we have the different diameters of the bar i will mention and on the right side i will find their unit weight in the unit of kilogram per meter let's start from the smallest bar we have eight millimeter die bar and we want to find its unit weight so this formula is used d square by 162.162. So putting the diameter of this bar, the diameter of this bar is 8 millimeter. So we will put the dia 8 square dividing it by 162.162. We will get the unit weight of the steel of this dia bar in the unit of kilogram per meter, right? So from this we get 0 0.40 kilogram per meter. So I will write this here, 0 0.40 kilogram per meter. So we can find also the different diameter of bar, the unit of the unit weight of each bars with respect to their uh, different diameters. For example, if I'm if I want to find the unit weight of 10 millimeter bar, right? 10 millimeter bar. So simply just put the d value here, 10. And, and taking the square dividing by the 162.162 we will get the required answer of the unit weight in the kilogram per meter for example this formula is also used here 162.162 and this d is here is 10 this diameter is always be in millimeter right the diameter of the bar should always be in millimeter because this formula is used to find the unit weight of the steel bar in the millimeter the D should be in millimeter and the answer is in kilogram per meter. This formula is derived from uh, the main, uh, main uh, concept that the, uh, uh, the, the, the D should be in millimeter and the answer should be in kilogram per meter. Now the 10 millimeter, so we will put D here 10, 10 square, dividing it by 162.162, so we get 0.62. So 0.62 is the unit weight of this steel bar. Similarly 12 millimeter we have 0.88 and then we have a 16 millimeter and 20 millimeter. So we can find their unit weight by this formula just by putting their diameter in millimeter in the formula so we will get their required values. Right? So now how to find the weight of any steel bar if we are given the length of the steel bar, right? To find the total weight of the steel bar. So, like, for example, if we are given with the steel bar, this is steel bar, and this is steel bar used, and the length of this steel bar is 12 meter, and this steel bar is number 8 millimeter bar, 8 millimeter bar. So we want to find their total weight of this steel bar. So we can find it easily, as we know that 8 millimeter bar is 0 0.40 kilogram per meter 0 0.40 kilogram per meter is the unit weight of this steel bar so now just multiplying it by the total length 12 meter so meter meter will be cancelled so we will get by multiplying these two quantities we will get 4.8 kilogram only this unit remains so 4.8 kilogram is the total weight of this steel bar it is really simple if you know if you know the logic behind this. Now, if I'm doing I'm doing now another example. Like for example, 
Consider the any, any other example, the steel bar, and its length is 10 meter is given to us, and this is 10 mil, and 10 millimeter bar is used. So we want to find the total weight of the steel bar. We know that the 10 millimeter bar is used, so we will get the unit weight from here, which is 0.62. So 0.62 is the unit weight, right? Kilogram per meter. It is per meter length. We want to find the total weight, so just multiplying with the total length, 10 meter, so meter meter will be cancelled. By multiplying these two quantities, we will get the 6.2 kilogram. So 6.2 kilogram is the weight of this steel bar having 10 meter length and a bar is 10 millimeter. So this was the today topic about the formula which is d squared by 162.162. This is mostly used and the quantity estimation so you should remember this formula and how to use and how to find the weight of the steel bar so this was all about the today topic and don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos thank you for watching our video